Uh, also, th- this was exciting news for me just because I hate USC so much. Uh, but they were, oh, yes. they were stripped of their 2004 championship. Thank you, Reggie. Reggie Bush was ruled ineligible for the entire season. So, uh-huh. because of that, and 2004 will just not have a champion. Nope. Well, you can't give it to the team that they beat because they completely annihilated them. I mean, they smashed Oklahoma. Yeah, well, it, I, the BCS is going to vacate the 2005 Orange Bowl, uh, which was a national championship game for that year. They're going to strip them of, what is it, 30 scholarships or just all of them for next year? I think 30. Right. Um, also, the uh, USC was in the 2006 Rose Bowl. Uh, that's the game they lost to Texas. Um, that is apparently, I mean, Texas still won, so it doesn't really matter, but apparently Texas just played nobody. That's what the books are going to look like. They played nobody, and they just gave them the trophy. Okay. Um, and also the BCS Presidential Oversight Committee um, said that, like we just said, there will just be no BCS champion in the record books for the 2004-2005 season. It's a shame because, I mean, Matt Liner did an interview, and he- playing devil's advocate he did bring up a good point saying that it's not like anybody you know took any peds which you know allegedly didn't take any peds so it's not like what they're getting what they're getting consequences for had anything to do with cheating during a game it's just dude and his family got set up in a ball and house yeah well and, and i mean along those same lines what Again, I don't like USC, so it doesn't matter to me. Nope. But, you know, you're punishing a team of almost 80 players for one person's actions. Exactly. Like, that's kind of it's kind, of, kind of a little messed up. Yeah, I'd say so. A little messed up. And then not only that, are players from the past getting punished, but people in the present are getting punished for something that happened seven years ago because now next year they won't be able to play in a bowl game. 30 scholarships gone. And, uh, you know, the two main culprits in the whole situation, Reggie Bush and Pete Carroll, are nowhere to be found. They, uh, don't, they don't care. Pete Carroll dipped. Oh, I mean, he knew the hammer was coming down, and he bounced. Went off to Seattle and uh, did pretty good in the playoffs last year, actually. So, you know, that uh, team's still horse crap. Oh, yeah.